And we are back with more Metro Exodus, continuing where the last episode left off. How are you folks doing? Olga, Alyosha here. I'm online as promised. I hope you can hear me. We did examine the dam and reservoir. You have to leave the valley, as soon as possible, at least before the rainy season starts. Come on, man. The dam is barely holding, and if it gives, the valley will be washed away, and everything that remains will be deadly. Oh my Tomorrow, god, we have rabbits? Even better, yesterday. Hello. How is she? Well, we have new start, and it seems to be bad. We haven't had any other variety in a long time, so no one. Take a seat, Bratucha. Boy, this conversation is not going to be simple, I think. Until today, we thought that this shot of Novosibirsk was a simple error. What's your wrong? The legend says, irradiated zones are highlighted in shades of green, while purple highlights indicate errors. Today, though, I found some small print. The thing is, radiation levels way outside of normal operational range of the scanner are also marked as errors. Simply put, the radiation there may well be completely off the scale. We're about 500 clicks from Novosibirsk, and the radiation wow. outside is almost Damn, as high as back in there. Moscow. It can't be a morehead. Ah, the shots are 20 years old. The radiation can't be quite as high now, but still, Novosibirsk is most probably so. What do we do now? I'll tell you what we do. Artyom and I will go. This is not right. the other way. We go no. together. So, not our please. Right first. She is my daughter. His wife. My paranoia about the occupation forces drove her into that damned bunker. And Artyom with his dream. He dragged us out of Moscow. So we too are to blame. Really? Still, we are the Order. We are one crew and we should all act accordingly. We should all go. Discussion is closed. This is not an Order mission. It is a personal errand. Mine and Artyom's. We don't need any help. Second, we don't know the exact location of the medicine. It might be in the city center, or in one of the Akadem Gorodok labs. Zahana's life might well end up in your hands, too. Third and last, wherever we might go, winter is coming. And getting the Aurora stuck in snow is what? That's something we can't allow. Do you remember what Yermak said? Remind the huge railway technology museum at the city outskirts. We'll almost certainly find a snowplow for the Aurora there. So, gentlemen, your missions are to search the Akadem Gorodot labs and prepare Aurora for the winter. Okay, that sounds like a great idea. Get ready for the mission. Aye, aye, Dad. Also, we are starting constant radiation level monitoring outside. Effective immediately. Sam. Your first. Yes, sir. I think that lethal radiation levels there are actually good news for us. Uh, you mean there was nobody left to rob the drugstores and hospitals? <laughs> exactly. Unlike the towns we've been. This is a goddamn suicide mission. Colonel, sir. An update on the suits. Yes. What's the situation? Hey, Sam. Artyom, I wanted to say, look, I, I spent 20 years with you people. We almost burned the planet down trying to kill each other once. And we should be enemies, I guess. But, you know, when the Colonel took me from that crowd, the women and children beat me up. I was scared. I couldn't raise my hands. I'm not a beast. No, I sure was strong then. So, I'm sorry, but since 
Sometimes I feel that it's important to not raise a hand. To not cross that line that separates a man from a beast. I don't know what's waiting for you and the Colonel in that dead city. But remember that line. With the shield, or on it, soldier. Thanks for the talk, Sam. You know, uh, he's actually getting his own DLC, I think. Which is cool. I think it was already confirmed and it's going to be about him going back to America or something? They're attempting to. I want to jump off the train! isn't giving up. Oh, God. She believes in me, believes in us, and for a good reason. Thousands of kilometers of track behind us. We are finally approaching Novosibirsk, a dead city concealing her hope for life, the medicine that could save her, somewhere in its cold, irradiated heart. A year ago, we left the poisoned ruins of Moscow. And now we are about to enter another city stiff in the murderous embrace of winter and radiation. Will we ever find somewhere to live on the surface? Maybe. But for now, we're returning back into the bowels of Metro. Back to Savana. Oh shit, is this the end of the game? I thought it went like full circle. Well, we did winter in the beginning. Yeah, so this may be the end. Fuck. I was hoping to reach 30 vids exactly for this series. I mean, with the main, so... Oh, uh, yeah, but now it's winter. How do you know? We're here. Novosibirsk. Sure hope this time it's not another bunch of nuts. The bridges are undamaged, and the radiation's climbing like crazy. I think there'll be no nutcases this time. I really hope I get the good ending. The houses are undamaged too. Sam, what's with the radiation? Eight times higher than in Moscow and still climbing, Colonel. I think we better not stay outside for too long here. Are you ready, Artem? All right, Dad. Let's do this thing. Follow me. Good let's luck. let's do this back. shit. Let's go into PUBG. I only have a fucking minute. I'm gonna die. Girl, the situation here looks more complex than we thought. Still, time is short, so we're taking the direct approach. Let's refresh the plan. Yurimac! We'll take the Aurora south to the Sibirskaya cargo station. Uh, I'm not the best upon. Chris, Sam, Idiot, and I will handle the Institute building in Akaden Gorodok. We'll pay a visit to the Railroad Museum on the way. There might be something for the Aurora there. I'm staying to guard the Aurora with Tokarev. Good. Artyom and I are checking the Institute's main building. Radiation is way too high here, so we'll try to get there through the metro. Well, let's get to it. Good luck, Spartans. Good, Good luck. luck. Good luck. Break a leg, my friend. You don't get carried away out there, because I know you. Yeah, I literally only have a minute of fresh air, so... Are you going out on a mission to save Aunt Anna? <sighs> yes. Um, could you please... 
please watch over her for us until Artem and I come back? Please? Of course. Teddy and I will be her guard. Will you help me, Teddy? Drive a Teddy mission acknowledged. Oh, God, that teddy bear was hell to get. She's sleeping. Are you leaving? Yes. I hope we'll make it in time. Okay, the radiation's not that bad. It's in the yellow. We're fine. It's not, what, fucking Hulk level of radiation. We're not gonna get gamma rayed. The attack ended. I did my best. So you don't have to worry. Her pulse is strong. She's just exhausted. She'll probably sleep till tomorrow now. Yeah, I get priority over dad. Yeah. Come back soon. Seeing you would be the best medicine. Good luck. Right here, Colonel Sir. Thank you. Artyom, this is no Moscow where you could loiter outside for months. Who knows what monsters live here? So think well what to pack. I'll be waiting at the car. Gear up, Artyom. I cleaned your guns and put all the ammo and resources we had left in here. You're going to need it. God damn it. Well, okay then. You ready? Why do we not have ammo for this gun? God damn it, where's the ammo? Son of a bitch. We got ammo for this? Nope. Okay, then. Fuck me.
Well, I know we got shotgun rounds. Yep, smoke them if you got them. Artyom, promise me this one thing. You guys get there and back quickly. We cure Anna, and we all go searching for a place to live. Well, I didn't okay. know I could do that. Okay. Is this my van? My van! This is how we lose the car. This is how we lose the car. So, how do you find the road to your dream? Do you wish we never set out? I can see that. Well, let's put those feelings away for the moment, Artyom. We can handle this. I think we can get out through there. Hold on! And then a giant fucking bat takes the car or something. Just wait. Quite close to our position. Shit. Oh, I'm fucking waiting for it. This road should get us to the city center. They take it, but keep looking around. There might be a way into the metro on the way. So much snow, and this storm is getting worse by the minute. Uh, weird feeling. The buildings are intact, but the city is dead. Don't you think Moscow was better, eh? Navigating much here, man. Careful, Arthur. Careful. The weather is still getting worse. 
as well as the radiation. We can't stay here. Turn left. There. That way should take us back to the main road. God damn it! Another car pile! It seems like a tank that Let's follow it! Damn snow. <laughs> oh, shit, shit, shit. The institute is a stone throw from there. Well, I could walk the faster. Very deep here, and with the radiation so high, the locals if you were moved. didn't last long. It's a bit safer down here. Though we've already taken a little trip on the norm up there. The tunnels. This is just like back home. We're in our element here. Go. What do you know? The air is breathable. Yeah, what do you know? Where's the giant spiders? Uh, mutants again. Going to have a go at us. Let him try. Take a look around, Artyom. We need to get into the tunnel next to ours. And this is how I die. Are you okay? Good. Damn it! Get some! Gotta reload. Damn it. 
die, you fucking asshole. These are probably related to the mutants from back home. This metro is crawling with them. I guess we can handle these. What do these things even mean? Not people, that's for sure. Oh my god, power? So much dust. Abandoned a long time ago. Look around here, Artyom. You might find something useful. Well, my flashlight seems to be forever dead. Due to that green stuff, the radio protector, the military issued. And then their stores ran dry. But the radiation was still there. And that was it. Okay then. So with that everybody, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Why am I bleeding? Oh god. Wait, did I get bit? We've run out of time as usual. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching and hopefully see you guys in the next one. Goodbye everybody. See you later.